Look what changes. Look all of that. There's mm -hmm. nothing there, Cameron. That's like your book, isn't it? Mm -hmm. The nooks and they built those houses. Wow. So we look at it in like the 1700s. Wow, that's wow. massive. Mummy, look how it's getting built. Look, it's getting built even further. Then in about. Mummy, in about 1900, 1950, about, that was when they... And then you have trains. Oh, look, Doctor. We are in, is it the Museum of Liverpool? Yeah. We are in the Museum of Liverpool. It's raining. We've had food. We've been in the fair. And now, in the Liverpool. Got half of it. What would you call? Maintenance. Closed for maintenance. Food. Come on, look, there used to be loads of them. Oh, yeah. Go in, I'll come with you. Oh, you like that? That used to be their bath. Let's do it again. Someone going there. Right. No, right, no. I'll Hello. Come and look at all the Barbies. Where is the map? To the churches. To the schools. See, to the churches again. There's loads of churches and not that many schools in like this bit. Is that what the live bird looks like, Marie? Is a live a bird? She took pictures. I thought it was With my phone or your phone. Do that live a bird up there? Is that how big it is that how big it is? If it is, that's massive. What? That one on the wall. Wait, no, He's standing in front of a model of the area outside the museum, <laughs> the Pier Head, one of the most famous parts of Liverpool. Oh, yeah. To your left there. is a large window facing that's the same there. area. The window faces north, that's with the River Mersey flowing north to the left of the museum. Sure the River Mersey is the area known as Will. On this side of the river, See that the Mersey Ferry Terminal Building is there. Floating on the river behind is the metal structure of the ferry landing bridge. Which is that's everything that's happened in Liverpool in like the past from 1811 to 1980. Is this like a tiny version of the
we go to the um, Beatles story thing? Come on, what are you trying to do? You trying to sit down? Yeah, By the 1960s, the docks were in serious decline, meaning there was a desperate need for new employers. The arrival of Ford at Halewood promised 15,000 much-needed new jobs to build their new Anglia car. And I started to work on Monday as a factory messenger on five shillings a week. The odds didn't like what I was doing as I was moved onto the conveyor to make the new car called Zinky. No. But you've done a lot of you know. But it wasn't a machine gun, was it? More than I think that was five dollars. What? 3p for a scone? 8p. Oh my god. Five p for a packet of biscuits. How good is that? I wish I lived in the 1950s. How bad is that? We hate for scones. Am I there? Am I there? Am I top? You've got the same badge as me, haven't you? Let me see your badge. We'll just know through the day and the skylark sang, and the smell of the dead as on the open ground got worse. Then we were released, and back behind our lines, an officer gave roll call. Over Is 50 that what men the now got like? to over the top, but just a handful of us were left to answer our names. And the new men here behind the lines asked me, What's it like out there? And I say, go on for a little wire and find my pal Harry. Find Harry. Ask him what it's like out there. Who had a sheep dog called Martha? He wrote a song about Natchez. He played the Indian sitar. He had the middle name Winston. Jerry and the pacemaker. Why? Because that's them. They did very good Oh, and what looks the film? Tasha! Look, can you see that? Yeah, it's right in a square. It's my phone. Daddy, can you see that? <laughs> see what? That. Well, you have squares on your phone and it's pretty right in the middle. Oh, you can't even see it on this. We're going home now. We've got our marbles. 